Hey everyone, it's Wingspan TT, the fourth best commentator on YouTube, and today I want to share something with you guys. I had someone asking on my video, I actually had a couple of people asking, um, Wingspan, what is Animus Hack? What is Minor Hack? Uh, I don't understand what these killstreaks do. I understand all the other ones better, so can you please explain it? And I've had this footage for a while, you can see here on Prestige 7, this is before I became Legendary Grade, but I had this footage, and I just want to have the right opportunity to share it. I'm in this game with Hackamack Attack, the uh, the Hack Attacker, and uh, six other terrible noobs, uh, I, you know, I don't want to be mean, those people who are relatively low level. And uh, if you don't know who Hackamack Attack is, this is a guy who is, at least in, in the top tier tactics, uh, world of Assassin's Creed yesteryear, this guy was like a tournament favorite. He was notorious for using Animus Hack to win deathmatch matches. I mean, he destroyed people with it. Like, it was absolutely brutal. And um, I, this match, therefore, you're, you can guess that he does unleash the Hack Mac Attack Hack Attack. And uh, I think it will. This it's it's really good video for demonstrating what what Animus Hack is, uh, why it's good, why it's not good. That kind of thing. But before I get into it, the, the long and short of it is that Animus Hack. Uh, let's let's start with with something basic here. Minor Hack is a loss streak where if you have Minor Hack, you can kill your target from any distance. And I saw there that my pursuer, I believe, got hit by a poison dart. So I was like trying to run away. And see, she she dropped dead. So I was right. I saw her grab at her neck. And here's a Hack and Mac attack. There, he's my target. Anyway, Minor Hack allows you to kill your target or you know wrongfully an NPC if you fuck up it allows you to kill your target from any distance instantly like basically instead of like you can lock on at any distance and instead of like having the X button when you get close you can literally just assassinate them at distance for like uh, some minor amount of points okay so minor hack is a really bad perk in my opinion it really sucks Almost all the other Lost Streaks are better, like, Score Doubler is pretty much the best Lost Streak in almost every situation. There's some situations where the other ones are better, uh, but Minor Hack sucks. Animus Hack is totally different. So Animus Hack is when you get Animus Hack for like 20 to 30 seconds, I'm not sure the exact timing, feel free to like check it in this video when it happens. Um, you can literally kill any player, your target, your pursuer, neutral players, you can kill any character on the map from any distance for like 20-30 seconds. So that's, that's, that's a start. And then not only that, it's like the score you get for each kill goes up the more kills you have. So for instance, the first kill is worth like 100 points and then it's 150 years, 200, 300, that kind of thing. It just climbs and this guy is like, oh, I'm just going to kill random. Boom! Right in the face. So Animus Hack um, is pretty much only good for deathmatch for a couple of reasons. So the main reason it's good for deathmatch is because if you can kill anyone, obviously it's best that you kill as many people as possible, right? But because in Wanted, Assassinate, all these other modes, the maps are very big, it's like how many people are you realistically going to kill with Animus Hack? Like how many people total will you get to actually run into? Like three, four? Three or four people. So maybe you'll get like 600 points or so out of it. And then here, Hackamack Attack gets a very nice kill on it for 700 points. The other problem with using uh, Animus Hack in other game modes is let's say you're playing Wanted, right? And you want to kill players. Well, the problem is you don't know who the players are, all right? So if they just go into blend groups, good luck. But in Deathmatch, because there's no duplicates, like, all right, so this guy's the duelist. I know that he's a real player because there's no other duelist. Like, there's no duplicates. Now, yes, he could be wearing a disguise or something like that. I'm just talking about in general. So deathmatch is pretty much the only place where you can use uh, animus hack easily and well because you have a small confined space where people you are going to run into maximum number of players and it's easy to identify players. So those are the two things that make animus hack good. Now there's other situations where, where you can use animus hack um, that aren't necessarily 100% effective but they're hilarious. So for instance, let's say you are in manhunt um, on defense, right? If you score enough stuns. <laughs> If you score enough stuns to earn an animus hack that you as the defender could animus hack and kill the four pursuer uh, targets, which is absolutely hilarious. We see here animus uh, hack and attack was going for the blow dart, the poison dart, and I really should just run and get the kill. I didn't realize how many pursuers he had, so uh, the puppeteer here took my kill. Good on her. 
Um, Animus Hack, you could also use it for similar reasons in Artifact Assault or Domination. Or Domination, you can be on defense and kill lots of people, earn an Animus Hack, and then run into a zone where you need to capture it. <laughs> And uh, immediately, uh, I don't know, and just kill all Purge of Sewers. So here, the Animus has been hacked. Hackamack attacked here. You can see him walking around there. He's looking for targets. And you'll see, like, just watch. He's running around. He's looking for targets. He's just going to kill people. Now, I kind of do something risky here and kill this guy. Because I knew if I didn't kill him, Hackamack attack would be able to kill him. So I'm going to take the 950 points. Hackamack attack still running around, looking for targets to Animus hack. And he kills this guy. And right now, though, he is going to bite the bullet. Because my target's going to get him. And it's, he's probably had been around with the hack for like 17, 18 seconds or so. So by the time he respawns his Animus hack, I think it's going to be over. Maybe he has time for one more Animus hack. Because it does carry over through respawn. But you see now, I'm like 1,500 points behind. Which is not good. I'm just going to hang out in this in this pile and hope the puppeteer kind of like wanders my way. But now I'm getting like, like nervous that this guy's my pursuer. And he is. I come out for the easy stun. But he knew where I was. He knew I was in the hay bale. He sniffed me out. Like a piece of garbage I was. And now Hackamack attack 3,000 points ahead of me. So you see, um, Animus Hack, you get a lot of points. Like when you pull it off correctly, it's like you easily get 100 points, 200 points, 300 points, 400 points, 500 points. Like you can easily score thousands of points off it. Oh, I guess the hack attack is still active. There's one more hack at least. I don't know. My time was totally wrong. Anyway, he got lots of hacks. I'm going to guess that he probably got off like six or so kills, which is pretty decent. Um, and there was all kinds of weird shit going on there. So he, he kind of got like probably 2,000, maybe even 2,500 points off Hack Attack. The people be like, oh, clearly Hack Attack is the best um, kill streak you should always use in Deathmatch. Well, that's not totally true. And the reason is this, all right? So Hack, Animus Hack requires a streak of 13. So that's 13 kills or like six and a half silent kills or like, you know, six silent kills and a stun or it's a lot. It is a lot. And it's so many that you pretty much have to take kill buffer, which is a perk that means that when you die, you don't lose all of your kill streak. You just lose one of it. Okay? So the problem with this is, so now you have a kill streak that requires a huge amount of kills, and you, ha you have to use one of your perks to take up a spot. So that's great, but what if you don't get the Animus hack off? Or what if you get the Animus hack off with like 15 seconds left on the clock? Or you get the Animus hack off and you can't find any of your targets. So now you have, and I don't know what the fuck happened right there, but it's really messed up. So you can see now there's like seven minutes in. I have Animus Hack equipped too, and I haven't gotten to use Animus Hack. So, so if I had, let's say, something like, you know, plus 550 score, or if I had Revelation or something like that, I definitely would have triggered it by now, or I would have triggered it even possibly twice if I had one of the lower level uh, streaks. So that's Animus Hack. It's, it's extremely high, and I really should wait here. It's very high reward, but it's also very high risk. And it's very low chance that you'll get it to happen. And here we're playing against relatively low level players. But against high level players, like the odds that you're going to successfully get off an Animus Hack in Deathmatch is much, much lower. And even if you get it off, they know how to counter Animus Hack. All of your targets are going to immediately hide, okay? They're going to immediately hide or they're going to disrupt you or they're going to like use um, time phase on you or firecrackers. They're going to use abilities that make it very difficult for you to get off Animus Hack. So then maybe even if you get it off, um, odds are you're not going to kill You're going to kill like one to three people. And that means you, you use your kill streak the entire match to only get like one or two kills, which is terrible. And here I'm just going to try to go for the full set focus because I think I can. And now I'm one shot away from getting my Animus Hack. And I don't know, I don't even know. Like, I, I'm watching this now because I recorded this like a month ago. I don't even know how I knew that that was Hackamack Attack. I just remember thinking, like, this is my pursuer. People ask me, Wingspan, how do you know it's your pursuer? Like, I don't know, I'm fucking psychic. What do you want me to tell you? My, um, I'm psychic. Uh, my ghost dad tells me things. Um, not that my dad is dead, but, you know, I just have a separate dad who's a ghost dad. Here, my pursuer, and I was like hoping that she'd get distracted enough that she wouldn't know it was me. And just see, like, people are also like, how do you get the stuns on them? Like, I gave that person something to believe. Like, I walked towards her, she's like, this is my pursuer. That, that's my pursuer, by the way. You can tell by the fact he's walking straight to me. I walked towards her, she's like, this is it. But then I, like, stopped for a second, and the decoy's still running around. So, you know, in her head, she's probably like, oh, well, that's probably a decoy, but it's probably, you know, it's definitely a decoy. But then because my behavior was so weird, there's a moment where she just doubted, like, wait, wait, whoa, whoa, wait a second, maybe that is not a decoy, maybe that is wing spam. And she went back. So sometimes what you have to do, especially in situations where you have no realistic chance 
of winning, you have to give the person something to believe. And here we go. Fucking Animus Hack. I have the power! Except I get stabbed. Um, so I've activated my uh, my Animus Hack. Hack Mac Attack, though. Still with a commanding lead. 800 points, though, over me. And now I'm losing, like, 10 seconds on my Animus Hack. However, you'll see I quickly... I'm going to make up for that. So the immediate thing you get at a deathmatch, you want to start looking for people who are clearly players. Like this guy, Dandy, is a player. Kill him. Okay, this guy's a player. Kill him. 200 points. This guy's a player. You're dead too. Blah, blah, blah. 300 points. 400 points. Now I got like 80, 300 points. Looking around. I should have realized that that doctor is a player. Like it took me a second. Yep, there we go. Animus hack. <laughs> and if you haven't seen my fucking music video, Animus hack that I did a rainstorm, like you have to watch it. Here, I lose my thing. But I easily make up for lost ground. 8,800 points. I probably could have gotten one more Animus hack if I was paying attention. Um, taking the lead, somehow being uh, just edging over Hackamack Attack on his Animus Hack. But Hackamack Attack got really unlucky. Like, he got killed right in the middle of his Animus Hack. Getting killed at the beginning is not nearly uh, as disruptive or getting killed at the end of it. But in the middle, you lose a lot of momentum. And just barely edging by him. It was like 14 kills. I even had one more death than him. It's a really good game. And I don't even um, remember what uh, message I sent him here, so let's just go back in time doo -doo 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 -doo, and see this. Yes, I'm doing the Ubisoft uh, back in time thing. And by the way, I was at E3 when that was done on stage at Ubisoft, and it was absolutely um, horrifying and hilarious at the same time. What the hell did I said? Haha, -ha, GG, out hacked. <laughs> I have to be that classless. Anyway, everyone, Wingspan TT from TopTradeTactics.com. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you got an understanding of what Animus Hack is, both from watching the footage and my overall commentary. If you want more Top Tier Tactics and strategy, go to TopTradeTactics.com, where you can find my full Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag Multiplayer Strategy Guide coming out chapter by chapter. And until you do that, I guess I'll uh, see you then. Cheers! Hey everyone, it's Wingspan TT, and if you're watching, you know what time it is. No, it's not time for your typical commentary. It's time for Assassin's Creed 3. This is where it begins, but it's also where it ends. We're not friends, you can't blend. We can't make amends. I've got a lens, and it's focusing in for the kill. Fill my incognito meter, sweeter bonus is still. I'm not ashamed of variety. Piety is for the weak. A sneak in poison, so your prognosis is bleak. So don't speak about the fights that you think that you won. Hold your tongue for a second, then hold your throat, then you're done. Animus hacking, I'm cracking code left and right. Fight or flight, you're all getting hunted tonight. Think the worst of it's over? Wanna stage a comeback? Well, I got some bad news, kid. You got hacked. They call me Wingspan, I'm an angry bird. I'm like Toucan Sam, bitch, and I smell a big turd. Just follow my nose. Don't need to use a compass, no accomplice, free for all, so accomplished. There's only so many times I can defeat you, I'll treat you. Let me teach you how I beat you, lead you straight to your own demise. Through on disguise, you just can't trust your own eyes. Went to the roots like you, the Cage Crusader, but you ain't the Batman. I'll cap you later, haters crying when they die into my motherfucking pistol on your ass like I'm Levi. Leave you faster than Bristol, I got the bang bang, left out the kiss kiss. The higher your profile, lower the chance that I miss mistaken if you think you're safe inside a haystack too big to be a needle sniff you out like wolf pack animus hacking I'm cracking code left and right fight or flight you're all getting hunted tonight think the worst of it's over want to stage a comeback well I got some bad news punk you got hacked no shelter no safe house you're not in the clear fear your next impending nightmare is here cuz the storm is coming the animus starts to shake let's see if you're ready to take on rain and storm wake I'll take the mic wing don't make me take it by force I know the code at its source it's just a matter of course I'll take the contest no opposition to prison the jury is in but every witness is missing I'm pissing everyone off as I off all the haters try me son I shit on runners and betas bombs don't fucking phase me I don't get fooled by your traps you're full of crap I'm scrapping every single skull cap but point for point that's not how this goes down I'll surround and flood you with fear until you drown the rain is approaching you can hear thunder crack it's too late to turn back cause you've been animus hat it's the natural order survival of the fittest so witness your future's darker than a guinness win this with both hands behind my animus I'll handle this smoke your ass like top tier cannabis YOLO, but you die a million times My rhymes define the line between your skills and mine Fine, 
You trying to activate your kill streak? Pip squeak, you pulled the same shit last week. Recall your fall from grace when I stunned you in a chase. Dispatch a short of haste, Vidic laughing in your face. Erasing all your preconceived notions about me. Got more absurd go credits than Fett for Solo's bounty. Making paper, getting kills, money bombing, dollar bills, fire cracking at your feet. Knock your ass out on the street. Kevin Cosner, bodyguard, stunning suckers isn't hard. Decoy luring out the fool's apothecary, poison school, throwing knives, slinging shit. Get another rage, quick, hunt you down, hunt you. Up, ice you like the Stanley Cup, Chiromancy breaking bones, got you trapped like Home Alone, make you take a dirt nap, hack attack the whole map.